What's good guys? It's your girl Keisha Ariel and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will be sharing with you my six week lock update with my braid locks. So let's jump right into it. Okay guys, so I am six weeks along my braid lock journey and guys, I, I don't know, but I've always said this, right? When my hair looks frizzy, I actually like it the best. You know, um, I used to think like neat locks is for me. And as you guys can see in week four update, which will be linked right here, me personally, I prefer this look. I prefer this look. I was like, oh my God, I can't believe I sat on camera with my hair like that. But, you know, it's to kind of show you guys what really goes down along your lock journey. And yeah, I was not loving it. And just like with my two strand twist, you know, that was also another reason why I never really like showing my hair because I was like, oh, I don't really like how it's looking right now. But you did notice that as my locks got longer, I was like, oh yeah, feel it <laughs> but you know I'm embracing this I really like I'm looking in the viewfinder I really like it like this a little bit more fuzzy it feels like you got more body and obviously because you know I have low density hair and fine hair strands you know the bigger my hair look the better I like it <laughs> but in today's video I'm just gonna share with you some things that I've been learning so far um, along the following two weeks that pre preceded, preceded? Yeah, preceded the, no, proceed meaning came before. You know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> So what I have learned in the weeks that followed my four week lock update is firstly that I have already um, started experiencing budding, like my locks are budding within the first month. Now I feel that is the case because with um, when I compare my lock journeys, right, um, with my two strand twist starter locks, now I can't quite remember my, my instant lock journey, like at what point that happened, but with my two strand twist, um, I believe my budding started about uh, month two, month three. Like I know it definitely happened within the first three months, but I don't think it happened within the first month. Now the reason why I feel that um, budding is happening much earlier or showing much earlier with my braid lock journey is because you know when you install braids obviously you know the length of the braids right it is a uh, much more finer and more compact but with the root even though um, you know it's tight initially as your locks grow right um, because you know the the roots get loosened so it only um have um space to puff up right here in the roots so when it comes time to interlock your roots you will see that budding um, effect where i'll show you all right so as you can see like a lot of the budding is happening here in my locks right here here is another one again and over here as well like all of my budding is like literally right here at the root so as i was saying right um because the roots are so much looser that when the hair starts to grow and um obviously you know it does don't really have nothing that it can wrap around and frizz up around so it all just like you know bundle up in the um the root so when i interlock you will see that that everything that was kind of like bundled up in the middle is now starting to just not not starting to do anything but more so it's just showing itself as in like the this budding right here right so with braid locks let me make sure i look decent <laughs> so with so with braid locks, what I would say is that you would see um, budding much sooner than if you had two strand twists, because like I mentioned with my two strand twist, um, it wasn't really noticeable because like the roots weren't as tight as when I installed my braid locks. Not that I plaited my hair real tight, but it was more so because of, um, you know, I interlocked the roots and I didn't interlock it like, like, 
like how you would do a braid when you, you know, you twist it, you, um, you plait it, right? So definitely I have noticed budding already. So the next thing I have noticed along my um, lock journey within the first six weeks is frizzing. My hair is very frizzy, which I really like because it definitely give my hair a fuller look. Now, as I mentioned, because I have fine, low density hair, you know, my braids do look quite quite thin so when it starts to frizz up when it starts to frizz up it just looks a little bit more um you know fluffy i guess so let me show you what it looked like at the back So if we were to compare what my hair looked like in the beginning, I would believe it would look different <laughs> because in the beginning, because I got fine low density hair, when you install your braids, your hair will look a lot more scanty. I'm hoping it doesn't look too scanty because I don't know what it looks like, but I'm assuming it wouldn't look so scanty because the, the frizz and the fluffiness and the new growth is kind of making it look a little bit more full. So yeah, so I know a lot of people talk about frizzing and stuff but frizzing is good it helps your hair to lock so yeah I love the frizz I love it I actually really prefer my hair like this rather than um, when it's quite neat so I don't know look at me trying to show off my length my little bit of length that I have because one thing as well another thing as well is that I notice when you wash your hair a lot it shrinks and it shrinks and it shrinks so sometimes I have to remind myself okay Keisha it's not that it's not that short it's not that short okay it's not that short okay it's not that short okay okay you feel me you feel me <laughs> so yeah so when you wash your hair as well it shrinks and it shrinks and it shrinks but I love my hair I do love it and the final thing I want to share about my love journey which to be honest I wasn't really expecting um, much difference um, in terms of the braids because I mean it's only six weeks and I believe when I was on my second lock journey yeah my second lock journey when I started with a two strand twist my hair started to look more like locks around month seven so you know six weeks I could still see the braids you can still see braids yeah you could still see the braids as you can see here I'm trying to hold it up but it wasn't like showing you guys much but yeah braids is still in effect yeah so i wasn't really expecting um my braids not to be visible but i just wanted to point that out that the braids are still there even though the frizziness is there um braids is still there so yeah so that's my six week lock update i hope you guys found today's video very helpful and if you did then please be sure to like comment share and subscribe if you're not already subscribed and until next week sunday at 5 p.m we will be right back here with another video